my computer, Randy. Oh, yeah. Well, what are you doing on my computer? Uh, I'm writing a reaction to the Bat Boy remake. I still don't know how to start this video. Hmm. Well, what if you just start it with you trying to write the beginning of it? That's a stupid idea. We'll just wing our reaction. I don't have wings! Garrett! <sighs> Hi, YouTube. It's me, Randy, your friend. And welcome to Randy's Reviews. This isn't a review, Randy. It's a reaction, and it's both of us. Same thing. Whatever. It really is a bit. Let's just watch this. Yeah, that's what I said, Garrett. It opens up with the tiles playing around the bat symbol, similar how the original Bat Boy tried to and failed. Yeah, but at least luckily they have that handsome nerdy guy in there. What was his name again? Slimy or something? Good looking ones. If you want. That guy is so dreamy. Do you think he's single? I thought you wanted to be with Holly Quinn or Ray. Well, yeah, if. Hardy Queen or Ray is available, but if not, I'll just have that handsome Sean Buffington guy instead. Well, they did something very clever here. They got footage from the original Bat Boy, so Bruce would look really young compared to now. Look at Val! The boss! I'm giving you a new assignment. I want you to find out about Bat Boy. He looks like Elvis and the Chipmunks. Does that mean that Super Fat dieted? He's not super fat, he's the boss. Do you think that, that just because they are played by the same guy, that means that they're the same person? And that's why they beat the crap out of each veil, so that's a plus to me. Meh, <laughs> <laughs> the original's better. You bite your tongue. Okay. Anyways, if this movie actually was released in theaters, I have a feeling it'd be up there along with spoofs like Spaceballs. Well, maybe, but no one ever seen the, the original one, so how would anyone know what you're making fun of? But luckily, I don't have to view any more Batman-based spoofs.